okay you take this example now you are not correctly selecting that is the issue possible has it no sir no sir i did for eyes and it i did that for eye and it was uh, successfully assigned to it fresh six no. successfully assigned to skin and mm -hmm. eyes later i was doing for ingestion and in fact i you know successfully added that phrase text like rains with plenty of water but while i was selecting it uh -huh. and moving it to the top of the bar it was not you know just getting can you see this do like this yes yes whatever you created that was not pulling up and whatever mm. earlier was there it was not pulling up what was the issue earlier i did for skin it pulled up and it got selected and successfully no, no, no. You i not placed my point to... whatever the mm -hmm. phrase already existed in the system you are able mm -hmm. to pull in that time mm -hmm. you got an issue or whenever you are uh, i mean the new phrase which you created and you are trying mm -hmm. to pull up in that time you got this issue i got uh, it uh, when i created it okay then you uh, try a uh, try with another phrase you create another phrase and uh, do it okay. it may come okay see form it's coming double click it came here mm -hmm. enter it here it's taking mm. save it that i successfully did for skin sir i uh, created phrase for skin and uh, the same thing i i did for skin and it successfully saved got inhalation saved. also but inhalation also see but don't inhalation i'm taking another one three statement mm. see it's coming see if it is coming for a skin it must come for inhalation there is no other option there is no other mechanism from the uh, for the inhalation and the skin i got it right okay both mechanism is the same only there is no different different mechanism for it okay you got it right so today we'll have a small class and the revision today okay most of the things will be revision okay. only today not revisions kind of a okay. spot test today right okay as it is uh, so much okay. of time and uh, you go you guys got uh, so much of time to practice it and kind of uh, like we'll have the small uh, test kind of a thing okay so last time basically we were uh, like went to the specification header we created the phrase phrase set other things we did it right so today mm -hmm. we'll go and see what is restriction restriction also if you go and see that restricting the values to certain places when i talk about right. a certain places it's basically certain regions okay, okay. for the certain regions we have to restrict the uh, like a values okay in this case what we'll do basically we'll do we'll do the settings you got okay. it right we'll do the settings in this settings nothing we'll do basically you will assign this this is released to the public or not and if it is released and we will going to select it here this is a rating here we have the rating and where here we will want to maintain the release for the customer this is a release for the dangerous goods uh, uh, regulations this is a release for the public all those things it will be always a release for the public or the customer specifically got it okay and then when i talk about release for a customer which customer which region customer that i am specifying here i am selecting a value as a value uh, value assignment category uh, validity area category as a region and validity area as a country or a region basically kind of a thing australia other things are you getting my point mm -hmm. yes sir value as area category and value validity area and the one is region and for the other is countries this country yeah i had mentioned the reg underscore word that means valid in a word okay if see second one okay. i took it as a region i'm taking as a bahrain mm -hmm. so this valid in a bahrain country was also the, can take it basically so validity okay. area will always be region yeah it can be region also okay see most of the time it will be region only it will be most of the time it is region okay. only or either you can set it as the plant level also supplier okay. level also okay these are the options sap has okay. given but mostly we will go with okay. the what i can say with the region only okay and, sir and what is excluding yes. if you have added a 15 countries in this and one of the country only you want to exclude it then you can use this exclude button okay means whichever country we have to exclude we have to mark that uh, yeah, right button select the, yeah you have to select yes, as a exclude. exclude button okay yeah got it yes sir. okay this is restriction basically and identifier we had completed so we will go with a yes. reference when i talk about reference we have to talk about a reference and a relationship okay so okay. let me take a reference now so i will go with a you can see reference specification take an example h2so4 and hcl there is two material h2so4 you already created the specification you maintain the data and going forward 
you got mm-hmm. a requirement uh, to create a specification for hcl you created a specification for hcl mm-hmm. but what you will do basically there is no mm-hmm. need to maintain the data again if the data of the h2s okay. for hcl same there is no need to maintain the data, data and again. another specification also what you can do basically you can refer h2s of for specification here and you can give the refer uh, reference specification number here and the condition basically whenever you are, you are taking the data reference of the specification that specification type should be real substance you cannot refer from the pure substance okay mm-hmm. end product okay. same or semi finished products yeah finished product semi finished product you take it as a real substance basically you take any material you can take a, any uh, take z3098 that is for h2so4 na 30 no no 30 uh, 92 i will take it 3092 it came now so if you are not maintain the data here also it will take a data from this specification but the condition you must maintain the data in this referring spe- uh, specification if you are not maintained system will not able to take a data yes, yes, the yes. Real if we have number. maintained data for s2s4 so and now we, we need to maintain data for hcl then we have to refer the data of s2s4 so for, for the hcl and that will be if, uh, visible uh, in this reference if a, if a data are same only if a both mm-hmm. the chemical data are same only in that case only we use a reference then go to the relationship relationship basically we call it as a inheritance inheritance template in the inheritance basically what is the thing the same purpose we use it as inheritance what is the difference between inheritance and our reference it's very simple in a inheritance if the both the materials some of the data take a example of now uh, take this now i'm pass i'm taking the data from another specification okay i will take a target specification actually i'll mention the target specification uh, as 96 okay and then okay and there is a template here if you use uh, this template right you can able to select the set of data in reference you cannot able to select the data for example if the physical chemical property only are same between two materials then you can use the inheritance mm-hmm. and you can copy that from the another specification but in reference okay. no everything will automatically copied are you getting my point sorry sir come once again in a reference this property can you see hmm. my cursor stand yes, property yes. trees all the data will be copied from another reference specification from the reference okay. specification okay. in case yeah. hcl for hcls all the properties are same in that case mm-hmm. you can use a reference okay, okay if the physical chemical properties or uh, pharmaceutical properties are only same only these two okay. properties are same between these two material then you can use mm-hmm. a inheritance inheritance okay okay right and one thing here either you can use a inheritance or a reference both you cannot use it that is a condition Got so it? why we, we we require a reference for those substances whose physical and chemical properties are different in that in that place we will use the inheritance no sir yes but i'm just telling you as a information i'm telling okay. you okay. got it right okay. both the things yes, cannot yes, use yes. it okay? okay that's it last of uh, specification last tab of specification is status 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 already i had told you that basically we have the rating rating is as you are just seen customer okay valid area availability area category are taken region and valid area are taken as a us state us is in process in process okay, okay. for us region people this specification okay. data is in process okay i can change it to release once i make it as a release they cannot able to change any data in this specification okay okay then so release means in, in a position to use does this release means posi- in a position to use yes then i will save it okay? okay it will be in fr now then what i'll do i will go to the next status which is a released then okay release so first we have to go for release, release then have to... for, for release yeah, that go, green flag. sir we have first we have to go for uh, release data for release no 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 it and will save. be now in process in process to for release for release okay. to release and every time we have to save it yes you have to save once every you time. make it as a process time. once you make okay. it in process you have to save it okay. then you have to go to the fr then save it fr is a for release okay. then save it okay then make it as a release so we, we need to we need to do this back to back or we we have to keep uh, in the uh, in process mode for some time and after some time we have to uh, select that in, uh, for release and after some time we have to uh, select release or we have to back to back do these steps in process not for release and release 
no 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 i'm just showing you this these are the options okay, are there okay. this will be okay. not done by us this will be done by the product compliance team okay okay so this will be done by them business not by us okay so then next go to the header status header status is always will be in a in a active condition that would be problem basically act 050 is a status for the active condition okay then the observed will come observed means basically like a like a, it's already done okay so like it's a, a basically not valid no sir sorry it's absolute that data is absolute completely is absolute okay. for select okay. this specification no, is absolute no more in use yeah. okay that's it on the specification we will continue on the next session i mean next topic on the next class which is basically report creation by using the ws server